and welcome back to a new vlog. So if you're watching this, you already know what it's going to be about. So I am going to Copenhagen with my mom for my birthday. So it's November 29th, Friday, tomorrow. It's my birthday. I'm turning 24. Um, yeah, I'm not a huge birthday person. Like I don't really care about birthdays. I don't feel the need to get presents or a cake or anything like that. But it's kind of nice to do something. And I have never been to Copenhagen. Um, let me see if I can put you down somewhere. Uh, so I've never been to Copenhagen, even if it's super close, but it was my mom's idea. So originally she wanted to come to Gothenburg where I live and we were gonna go to a spa. Uh, but as you can see, I have got a new tattoo. Uh, I did it on Tuesday, so three days ago. And of course you shouldn't go to a spa or sauna or like a pool or anything like that when your tattoo is healing. Yeah, I think that's one of the reasons it's so like splotched out because I went to a sauna two hours after I did a tattoo. Young and dumb. Um, but yeah, we're going to Copenhagen and my plan is to vlog as much as I can. My mom's coming with me. Hopefully she won't mind being the camera woman. <laughs> we'll see. I'm excited. I've got a lots of tips for vegan places. So high expectations and yeah, we're traveling tomorrow, the 30th, and then we're traveling back Sunday evening. So it's like 24 hours in Copenhagen. Hopefully lots of food involved, some wine, some cake. <laughs> and yeah, and then Monday morning, I'm actually traveling to Stockholm for um, like an um, interview um, film type of thing. So I might add that to this vlog. I don't really know. But yeah, that is my weekend plans and I'm gonna bring you with me. <laughs> also, because my mom's coming to visit, I have cleaned my whole apartment. So I'm gonna do a quick apartment tour because you've always wanted to see my apartment, but I've never shown it, I don't think. It's very yellow. You see hallway, bathroom in there my kitchen and I used to have a table here but I moved it and now I just have this white table where I do the majority of my photographing by the window and my bed so that is my mini 22 square meter apartment <laughs> Saturday, November the 30th, and it's my birthday. So I'm officially 24 years old, older and wiser, maybe. <laughs> Don't really feel it yet, but um, it is now quarter to nine in the morning, and we're getting ready, and then we're gonna take the train to Copenhagen. The 
this is. Okay, so we have just arrived at the hotel and what was it called? Axel Gunsmeden. Axel Gunsmeden. Um, this is the room. Gonna be sharing the bed and mom. <laughs> and I'm gonna show you the balcony because apparently we have one of those. It's like minus degrees, so I don't think we'll be using the balcony, but I mean, if you come here during the summer, then it will be amazing. So we took the train from Gothenburg uh, to Lund, and then we took another train from Lund to Copenhagen. Uh, all in all, it took like three hours, super quick to do. And of course, environmentally friendly to take the train instead of flying. Um, yeah, now we are super hungry, so we're gonna go for lunch. And I think we're gonna go to Souls, um, because they have cake and they have wine and they have amazing vegan food, or so I've heard. Super excited for that. Here is the bathroom. There's my mom there in the background. <laughs> Trying to hide from the camera. <laughs> that you go there as well. Um, yeah, it was super good. Dessert, chocolate, lunch, cake, all you need. <laughs> This is tonight's dinner look. Going for a black jumpsuit. Uh, but it is so cold, so I... This outfit is pretty much just for pictures because I'm just gonna put on my jumper. Um, and the plan is to go down uh, to the restaurant down here and eat dinner. They have 
some vegan options, so yeah. Hopefully I will find something I can eat and enjoy, but I will take you along so you can see what is on the menu and uh, yeah. So it's Saturday morning, we just had breakfast and we went to Beaumark. So we were gonna have a breakfast at the hotel, a breakfast buffet, but we weren't so sure about the vegan options. They felt like it was just gonna be a lot of like, meat and um, yeah, not vegan options. So I Googled, I found this place. It was also recommended to me by some of my followers. So thank you so much for that. Um, and they had acai bowls, uh, oatmeal. You could choose your toppings, three toppings. And it was really, really good. So I got a chia oatmeal with, I did some protein powder vegan pea protein, added salted almonds, blueberries, bananas. Um, yeah, highly recommend, but I would say go there hungry because the bowls were really, really big. Um, can I get your, <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, go there, bowl market. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I thought it was really nice, really filling, loads of different toppings to choose. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, just a nice atmosphere, everybody relaxed and chatting and spending time together. <laughs> yeah, uh, really friendly staff as well. So that's a plus. And uh, the rest of the day, we're just going to walk around. Where are we going? Um, we're going up to Niham. Niham. Uh, yeah, I'll take you with you. We'll see where we go. Yeah, but my YouTuber tip. As you can tell, it's a rather touristy place. Pretty much everyone is just standing here taking photos, so for once I don't feel so strange asking to have someone take my photo. It's like one of those places which is so pretty, which you just like want to have photos. It reminds, the whole of how it looks, reminds a lot of Sweden.
so when in Copenhagen, of course you do touristy things. Um, the little mermaid statue is one of those things. Definitely tell that it's a tourist place. Um, yeah, as I showed you, it's a mural statue. Um, yeah, gotta do it when you're here. Okay, so I'm standing now in Malmö Central, doing my last vlogging. So our last meal, we went to Simple Raw, um, and it was of course lots of raw food, but I don't think it's fully raw, only raw food now. It was really good. We didn't have to book a table or anything. It was uh, really nice staff. The atmosphere was really good, and the food was good, but of course not so big portions. Um, but I highly recommend. And now we're going to take the train home to Gothenburg. Uh, 24 hours in Copenhagen is over and I'm super exhausted. <laughs> My third cup of coffee. But yeah, thank you all so much for watching and I'm just going to let these people pass now. So I don't usually do vlogs but when I travel I do it so give this video a like, don't forget to subscribe, let me know what you think, if you have any other places I should visit in Copenhagen because it's so close. Um, yeah, I can just take a weekend away if I want to. Um, of course I want to thank my mom for this amazing trip, she's sitting waiting but it was all thanks to her that we went. Yeah, thank you all so much for watching. <laughs>